Room tags. Room tags are very useful for annotating our drawing. They give information about our interior and exterior spaces. Uh, this information can be used for creating a, a room-wise uh, project schedule. So we can put information based on its room. So we can treat a room just like any other thing, like any other element. Some of the things we might want to track uh, might be its occupancy, its department, what finishes are on the walls and on the you know the floors and things of that nature. Um, so we can track a lot of things about that particular room. To do this we're going to go up to the annotate tab and then we're going to go over um, in our annotate tab and we are going to go to uh, oops sorry we're going to go into architecture tab and in our room and area uh, panel we're going to go to room and we click on room and at the end of our cursor it actually will define the room notice as I move my cursor around inside a room it highlights the boundaries of that room so when I come over here it highlights each boundary of the room it also has place the tag on placement so once I pick with my left mouse I have placed the tag here so I'm gonna pick and now I have a room I'm still able to pick uh, these rooms and I can pick this room and I can pick this room and uh, when I'm done I'll hit escape alright now when I click on the room tag I end up with the room tag at this point and I can have it have a leader line or not so if I click on the leader line and then I grab a hole of this thing for example I can move it outside if I have a leader line if the leader line is on okay so I'll turn that off and I'll put it back into the room. Alright. If I double click on the room, ooh, there we go. We're in the room tag at this point. Uh, I'll bail out of there. And uh, uh, let me get out of there. Didn't mean to do that. But in our room, then we have a. Uh, we can actually click on this tag and instead of saying just room one, we'll call this master bedroom. Okay. And then we can click on this one and we can s click on it and we can say bath. All right. And so. Now we're tracking those particular room tags with information. Okay. And it's room number one, room number two, room number three in our schedule. Of course, if you don't like the positioning of them, you can move them around to wherever you like, etc. All right. So room tags are very helpful. We can build a lot of information that we'll track based on its room.